All right, we're out here. We're gonna film some more for uh, our Berlin Wall film. Got our costumes on again, and it's a pretty minimal crew. It's just me and Reina and tripod, other tripod. Okay, so the rest of the footage from that shoot was unusable. The audio was horrendous since we were shooting next to the highway. But that doesn't matter because in the final film it's going to be covered by music and that whole scene is just going to be music. So yeah. Alright, so I've got this Vietnam War kind of outfit that I'd like to uh, try and do some tests with. And then if they look good, I'll write like a larger script or story for a bigger Vietnam War. For now, we're just doing a test, so yeah. I've got blood and dirt caked all over me. I've got it on my hands. It's kind of caked in now. And then there's some blood on my face and whatnot. And then got some dirt on my pants, which is completely accidental. The uh, costume is not as good as I thought it was, but I think it would do if need be. The main character here is about to get into like a gunfight with one of the Viet Cong. So we'll see how that goes. Action! Dang it. All right, let me try that again. I kind of messed that up again. Actually, if I could like stand up and fire through that way, then I could do like a cooler stun fall. So can you like, I'll start here and it'll be the same framing as you had yeah. before, but then I'll pan up. Got it. Action! And action! We are done filming for the day. Uh, we finished up shooting that short, that is. And we didn't film much of the behind the scenes, but got a lot done. And I'll probably show you guys <laughs> some of the like VFX and editing behind the scenes stuff. So yeah. So I imported all that footage onto my computer and I edited it all together. So I was playing both of the parts there. I was playing the US soldier and the Viet Cong. Uh, soldier. There are two shots that I merged together just with a simple whip pan. There wasn't any fancy editing. It was just a hard cut. And what you do on the day is you do a whip like this and then another whip like this for your next shot and then you can kind of find a middle ground in between those and merge them together and it'll look something like this. Usually for my films I would do a single frame of a muzzle flash, usually from Production Crate. I do a lens flare under that, it looks kind of like this. And so then with the muzzle flash on top, it looks like this. But when we're shooting the scene for the Berlin Wall, I knew that I wanted to have that in slow motion, so I shot it in 60 FPS, and then I forgot to turn it back to 24 FPS. So we shot the whole Vietnam short in 60 frames per second. And so that doesn't really work to have a single flash, a muzzle flash. And so what I ended up doing is I downloaded this explosion effect and I kind of did some masking and fancy stuff to make it look more like a muzzle flash. And I added smoke and uh, the lens flare. So yeah, uh, here's that in slow motion just so you can see all the working parts. If you look closely, you can see the smoke. I applied a color grade to the rest of it and did sound design. Sound design is always one of the tougher parts for me. I'm not very good at it yet, as you can probably tell, but I think I got it to a place where I'm happy with it. Then I exported it and uploaded it, and now I'm sitting here talking to you about how I made it. All right, everybody, I have a couple of shots that I need to do with the dock set that I showed you guys last week, um, so I'm gonna do those. Also, I got these new LED panels. Um, there's one right here. As you can see, they are very bright. So they work really well. And if you look here, 
I am working on another different type of video. It's going to be a video making a diorama. So here's the cabin at this point. So yeah, stay tuned for that. I don't know when it'll be out, but... that's gonna do it for this week I will not have a vlog out next Saturday since I'm going to be on a trip in Kentucky uh, I know this vlog is getting long so I'll shut up let you get on with your day see you guys later <laughs> Bye.